Hey, so I wanted to uh, start out by reading off this comment that uh, I found on Facebook. Well, it was a post that uh, uh, one of my 4,000 Facebook friends made. I don't know this person, but I know a liar when I see one. So what this says is, uh, for the people that are complaining about people lying about actually being introverted and having social anxiety because of all the two weeks plus quarantines. Do you know that there's actually not stuff to do at home for two weeks straight, and it actually drives people crazy not doing anything and just sitting still? And I have to laugh because this thought just outed herself. Uh, if you have never sat in a dark room for two weeks gaming, playing the same game for two weeks straight, stopping only to eat, sleep, and shit. You've never experienced social anxiety. I'm, I'm just going out and saying that. Like, I don't even... My, I have a little bit of social anxiety. My social anxiety is not that bad. But, I mean, even I've spent, like, two weeks just sitting inside playing a game. Okay? <clears throat> now, there's a lot of shit that you can do. While you're in quarantine. And, and uh, you know, you, you probably should think about doing something. Because you're going to get fucking bored. I'm going to leave a link to a Mindfield video from uh, Vsauce about isolation. And, now uh, this, this video, uh, he, Michael, spends three days in total isolation. There's nothing to do. He doesn't even have a phone to, to fuck around with, okay? And he starts losing his mind. Now, what he did wrong was uh, he started out by doing all this high-energy crap. Uh, when you're in isolation, you should be starting out not doing high-energy crap. Like, uh, if I was in that situation, he's in this blank room, white walls, white everything, nothing to look at. So what I would do is go lay in the corner and just start imagining shit. Think about fantasy, dragons, dungeons, fucking uh, monsters and knights and motorcycle gangs and shit. Think about space. Do all that shit. And then when you run out of things to think about, then start doing this high-energy crap where you're walking around the room, counting your paces, uh, you know, singing the alphabet backwards and doing all that shit. But you're not in total isolation. You made a Facebook post. You probably used a computer or a phone or a tablet to do that. And if you have any one of those devices, you have literally the entire collection of human knowledge and entertainment at your fingertips. Okay? There's no reason for you to be fucking bored. <clears throat> uh, now, there's other things you can do. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'm going to circle back to that. You could draw, you could color, you could write, uh, you could do origami, you could fucking build paper planes for like two weeks. You could uh, build other shit. You know, there's all sorts of crazy shit you could do. You could experiment with culinary. You could experiment with cooking. Uh, <clears throat> I mean, of course, everyone's already cleaned all their fucking houses, so... You uh, probably won't need to do that for a little bit. Um, but let's get back to the technology part. You made this post on a phone. Like, let's just say it's a fucking iPhone. iPhones suck dick. But you made this post on an iPhone, right? I mean, you're a, a stupid thought. You probably have a fucking iPhone. Even iPhone has access to the Internet. Even iPhone has apps that you can download. There are games online. There are games you can download in app form on your phone from the Apple Store. Uh, you can fucking go on YouTube, get lost in a rabbit hole. You could uh, go on a weird forum. Uh, you could play around with some of the tools that are on the internet. Like... I found a, a forum on fusers, which are basically nuclear fusion devices you can build in your own home. Um, they don't, they're not very efficient. They uh, are really more just for looking at, and they're really cool looking. 
<clears throat> uh, I found uh, a, 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 a website that will take photos that you upload and give you the Fourier transform of those photos in in a visual form. You can fuck around with... You can do anything on the internet, man. I mean, let's just talk about YouTube right now. There, I mean, you could learn a new skill, too. Stanford, Yale, MIT, Harvard. They're all on YouTube. MIT, I know for a fact puts the homework for the classes that they have on YouTube in the comment, in the description of the YouTube videos. So you could do fucking homework, too. You could be, like, expanding your mind right now. You could be making uh, new skills, building up new skills, learning new things. But you're a thought. So you're just, you know, complaining about there not being any dick. Peace out.